Hello everyone, this is double elimination for nine teams. In nine teams, we have 16 games. And since nine is not included in the power of twos, meaning it has buy. And to determine the buy, we have buy equals power of two minus n, meaning we have seven buys in nine teams. Please take note that we use the asterisk to identify the buy. And since we have seven buys, we should place all the buys properly. In nine teams or nine number of entries, we bracket it into two. Five on the upper bracket and four in the lower bracket. And take note that we should always write all the number of entries vertically downward. Let us now place the buy properly. Meaning, we have two competing teams in the first round. Now, let's proceed to diagram and game schedule. Since we have seven buys, Meaning we have two competing teams in the first round, two and three. Now, let them play in the first round. Game one. And let us have the result. Winner one from game one. Now, let the buy play in the second round from the top let us have the vertical line from the top again we will prioritize the competing buys in the second round so this will be game 2 game 3 game 4 and this will be game 5. And then let us add the result from the top. Let us add the result from the top again. Winner 5 from game 5. Winner 2 from game 2. Winner 3 from game 3. And winner 4 from game 4. Now, we can now proceed to loser's bracket. is for the winner's bracket. And the other side is for the loser's bracket. Now, we will focus on the losers from game 1 to 5. Let's start with game 1. Loser 1 from game 1. Loser 2 from game 2. Loser 3 from game 3. Loser 4 from game 4. Loser 5 from game 5. Now, let all the losers play. Loser 1 versus loser 2. Loser 3 versus loser 4. So this will be game 6. And this will be game 7. Now let's proceed to winner's bracket. So the vertical line. So this will be game 8. 
and this will be game nine. Now let us have the result. Winner eight and winner nine. Now let's go back to losers bracket. So let us have the result. Winner six from game six. Winner seven from game seven. So let loser five play against winner six. So this will be game game ten. Let us have the result. Winner, winner 10. Now, let's go back to winner's bracket. So, this will be game. So, this will be game 11. Let us have the result. Winner 11. Now, let winner 10 and winner 7 play in game 12 let us have the result winner 12 now our concern is in winner's bracket is the loser 8 loser 9 and loser 11 so that let loser 8 be placed here loser 8 and play against winner 12 in game 13 and this is the result Winner 13. Okay, don't forget to write the broken line. Loser 8 from game 8. Okay, now next is the loser 9. So let the loser 9 play against winner 13. So that in game, in game 14, and let us have the result, winner 14. Okay, once again, don't forget to write the broken line, loser, loser 9. From game 9. Okay. Our next concern is the loser 11. So, loser 11 will be playing against winner 14. So loser, loser 11 in game, in game 15. Let us have the result. Winner, winner 15. So don't forget to write the uh, broken line. Loser 11 from game 11. Take note that in 9 teams in double elimination, we have 16 games. So that winner 15 
will be playing against winner 11. So winner 15. Let us have the vertical line. And this will be game 16, the final game. And let us have the result. Champion. Now, remember that in game 16, once winner 11 wins game 16, winner 11 will be the champion. However, if winner 15 wins game 16, winner 11 and winner 15 will have the same number of defeat or lose so that don't forget to write your note below your diagram that if winner 15 wins game 16 there shall be playoff or another set of game just to break the tie and to determine the champion in the final game now let's proceed to game schedule since we have 16 games now let's interpret the diagram in game one we have two versus three two versus three in game two we have four versus five four versus five in game three we have six versus seven six versus seven in game four we have eight versus nine eight versus nine in game five we have one versus winner one one versus winner one in game six we have loser one versus loser two loser one versus loser two in game seven we have loser three versus loser four loser three versus loser four in game eight we have winner 5 versus winner 2. Winner 5 versus winner 2. In game 9, we have winner 3 versus winner 4. Winner 3 versus winner 4. In game 10, we have loser 5 versus winner 6. Loser 5 versus winner 6. In game 11, we have winner 8 versus winner 9. Winner 8 versus winner 9. In game 12, we have winner 10 versus winner 7. Winner 10 versus winner 7. In game 13, we have winner 12 versus loser 8. Winner 12 versus loser 8. In game 14, we have loser 9 versus winner 13. Loser 9 versus winner 13. In game 15, we have winner 14 versus loser 11. Winner 14 versus loser 11. In game 16, we have winner 11 versus winner 15. Winner 11 versus winner 15. And then champion. This is the diagram and game schedule for 9 teams in double elimination.